Hi guys, Rob your PT here, thanks for joining me. In this video I'm going to show you how to effectively train your glutes. Yeah. I've got some really cool exercises for you that I use in both my own training and with my clients. Some of them are exercises that prepare your glutes for effective training and then others are main lifts that will really tax the muscle and get it developed and nice and strong. The benefits to having really developed and strong glutes are your posture is improved, you can relieve lower back pain, you'll be stronger in the gym, certainly on lifts like squats and deadlifts, you'll be a better runner or sprinter, and you will become more attractive. Good stuff. So let's get straight into some activation work. Here we've got a really simple glute bridge. So you've got your feet flat on the floor. We just want to be focusing on squeezing the glutes at the top of the rep. So we're raising the hips off the floor with our glutes. One of the drawbacks of this exercise is that the knees are flexed and a lot of people find it hard to really trigger their glutes doing this. So what I do is do a variation where the legs are straight. So here you see me with my legs supported on a foam roller and then we're just going to squeeze the glutes. Now this is much more effective for activating your glutes because your legs are straight. We take the hamstrings out of the equation so you can get more of a focus and an emphasis on your glutes squeezing. Here we have a single leg version of that glute bridge. Okay, this is a lot more difficult as it has a lot more instability, but it's a really good way to challenge that hip extension and really work the posterior chain, so hamstrings, glutes, lower back. It's also a nice method of evening out any imbalance that you have with one side being weaker than the other. So this next exercise is a really good one to use both for warming up and ramping up the nervous system, but also works if you work it a little bit heavier as a main lift for your glutes, okay? So again, it's working that posterior chain, so you will get hamstrings, you will get a bit of lower back. Great accessory exercise to help with your deadlifting. Why this is so effective is that the resistance of the cable is perfectly set against your hip extension, okay? So you're pushing your hips forward and the weight is pulling them backwards. So there's a lot of resistance perfectly against that hip extension. Next we have this exercise, I'm not going to call it back extension because we want it to be about hip extension. We want to squeeze your glutes at the top of the exercise. This machine is often used to train your lower back which for a bodybuilder if you want a thicker lower back visually, fair enough go ahead and do it. That is honestly the only time I think that it's relevant to directly isolate your lower back. Everyone's lower back is far too active and far too tight. When we do hip extension, people use their lower back far too much. Doing this exercise with emphasis on squeezing your glutes at the top is a great way to teach your body to use your glutes more for hip extension. Next exercise is one of my all-time favorites for glutes. This is a really nice exercise to get you stable and more athletic. It's essentially a reverse lunge, but we've got emphasis on standing on one leg when we finish and really driving that hip through. So we're extending one hip at a time. You should feel a massive squeeze in that glute that you're standing on at the top of each rep and do take your time to stand there and squeeze it, okay? So next we have a Romanian deadlift. I'm doing this one with a kettlebell, but you can use dumbbells, you can use a barbell. Similar exercise to the cable pull through that you saw earlier. A little bit more tricky to get the glutes working because the resistance isn't directly against that hip extension but it still makes it nice and effective and is a good transition between that cable pull through and a more conventional deadlift. Again just focus on squeezing those glutes at the top. Spend a few weeks trying out these exercises I promise your lifts will get heavier your bum will start to look nicer. If you're an athlete or a runner, your performance will increase. And as long as you're doing them correctly, these should contribute to you having a stronger and safer lower back. Please comment with any questions you have about these exercises. Hit the subscribe button below and thanks a lot for watching. Yeah.